Hey guys, what's up? It's Christine Seal, the High Level Queen, and today we are going to talk about how to set up follow-up reminders and appointment reminders to your personal Zoom link. And we're going to do this integration inside High Level. And if you don't already have High Level, what are you waiting for? It's the all-in-one software I use to replace all the tools I used to use in my agency. And you can get a free 14-day trial using the link below. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you like this video and let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that you're gonna wanna do is open up your Zoom, okay? Now you can do this with a free account. Don't let anyone tell you different. You don't have to have the paid version to do this. I don't have the paid version to do this. I probably should, but whatever. So you're gonna open Zoom, sign in, and go to set and then click this view more settings right here. Okay. Now it's going to open a link to zoom.us. You're going to have to sign in again. It's really annoying, whatever. Um, but this is what you need here. So this personal meeting ID and this, okay. Now you can click on edit and you can click on this use personal meeting ID for instant meetings. And that number is going to be the one that you need for your meetings. Okay. Now, if you want to go deeper into settings or you don't see that for some reason, you're going to have this setting in your settings here. Use or enable personal meeting ID. Okay. So you're going to want that to be turned on. Use your personal meeting ID when scheduling a meeting. You're going to want that turned on. And then use personal meeting ID when starting instant meeting. You probably want that on as well. And uh, make sure that you turn on the waiting room, okay? Since all the virus stuff happened, uh, the waiting room, actually Zoom added this for even the free accounts. I guess there was shady stuff going on. So um, make sure that you turn that on and that will prevent people from joining your sales call, like the next person from joining the previous sales call. Super important. You want to make sure that you get that turned on and that's just going to put them in a waiting room and then ask your permission to let them join. All right. So don't do that until you're done with your other call. It used to happen to us all the time. Thankfully it doesn't happen anymore. Then if you want to change your personal meeting ID or PMI as they call it, you actually have to have a paid account for that. And you can, you can upgrade. I'm not going to get into all that on this, but um, just know that that option is there if you want to get picky with it. Okay. So this link here, you're going to want to click show and you're going to want to copy that link to your clipboard. Okay. Copy that link to your clipboard. You're going to need it. Now, we're going to go to high level. And we're going to go to settings. And we're going to go to custom values. Okay. Then you're going to want to create a custom value called Zoom Link or, you know, Christine Zoom Link or salesperson number one Zoom Link, salesperson number two Zoom Link. However you have your calls structured, you're going to want to have another custom value for each person, okay? This is going to save you a lot of time, especially if you have turnover in your agency, okay? Because... No one wants to go through 50 campaigns and update the link for each one. This is going to let you only have to change it one time. Okay. So make a custom value called zoom link and then paste your zoom link here. Okay. That's all you got to do for that. All right. Then we're going to go into marketing campaigns. Now this account, I've got like a pretty little, uh, folders and campaigns already set up and everything like that for you. Uh, I'm just going to make a new one just to kind of show you like from the beginning. So new campaign. We're going to do appointment reminders for a demo. Okay. And I'm not going to put it in a folder because I'm going to delete it after I'm done with this. Okay. So make sure you specify which uh, calendar we're doing here. Okay. And then add an event. And then what we're going to do is we're going to do a 
SMS and then we're going to be like, hey, first name, it's, and then you can do like the owner first name with, and then you can do the, the business name. <clears throat> And then you're going to say something like, um, we provide booked appointments, or uh, if you do like prepaid booked appointments, or um, just whatever you don't say leads, please just <laughs> either prepaid booked appointments or booked appointments um, and clients who show up and buy. Um, and then here you're going to want to be like, add this to your calendar and then, um, appointment start time. So you're just going to do this drop down again there. And then you can be like, if you're unable to make this appointment, Please be courteous to both of us, notify us, uh, text us back, okay, something like that. Please be courteous to both of us and text us back at this number to reschedule, okay? All right, so that goes immediately. Okay, it goes after zero minutes, so I mean, you want it to be like reasonable. So what I usually do is I uh, I will do like when and then eight to five, Monday through Friday or something like that. That way, if you're like catching up at the end of the day and you're booking the appointments at midnight, they're not going to get a text and be like, what the? But if you never do that, then don't don't bother with this part okay um and then you're gonna add another one and this time it's gonna be an email and then this is gonna be like whatever your your session is called right do you have a demo do you have a strategy session please don't call it that do you have an audit do you have a snap audit or <laughs> whatever you want to call it um, Okay, whatever. And then here, uh, hey, name, it's, and then this is going to be owner first name with location name again, doing the same kind of thingy. Um, can't wait for our call tomorrow at appointment start time. Here is the link to join during that time. Boom. Here's your, here is your Zoom link. Okay. Um, we'll be chatting about, uh, the top three ways to get you more paying clients in the door. Okay. Um, so you can dominate your market. I'm just, please don't copy this word for word because I want you guys to be original. I'm just making this up as I go along. Um, looking forward to our call regards. And then you can do, uh, Account owner first name again, okay? Oh snap! Then that will put the event on their calendar, okay? The uh, um, immediate. Then what we do is we do 23 hours before, and then we do um, okay, and then we do like a recap. So, like, same kind of structure as before, um, but we'll be covering 
x, y, z, can't wait to dominate with you, something like that. Get them hyped up, put your testimonials in there, okay, put your testimonials, um, put your proof, your social proof, screenshots, like whatever you can put in here to get them hyped up. Sally made $100,000 in three months with our program, okay? Um, Fred made, you know, $20,000 in his first two months. I don't know. Just put your results in there, okay? I can't tell you what those are, but that's going to be super important to get them to show up for the meeting, all right? Then you're going to make this before 23 hours, okay? And then um, another text. I would do two hours before. I can't wait to talk to you today. Looking forward to speaking at appointment. You only need the time, so pick the time. Just making sure we are still on for today. And then I like to add this BT dubs. Um, emailed you more details yesterday so they know if they like missed your email. And this is before 100. This is before two hours. I don't know why I said 100. And then before 15 minutes is your last one. Okay. Our snap audit is in 15 minutes, something like that, okay? And then this is before 15 minutes. This is the best uh, setup that we have found and to get the best results. Um, so it's not like a big secret. Uh, we've tested this for like the past year. And our no-show rate is literally maybe one out of a hundred uh, or less. We just don't get them. So try this out, guys. Put proof in your emails. Put proof. Uh, pictures, like I said, that's going to be super important to get people to show up. And uh, let me know how you go. Uh, also, you're going to want, like I said, this Zoom link. You're going to want to put it like in here as well in in the tomorrow email and depending on your niche you may even want to put it in the text itself you can join here okay Zoom link. all right because they may not see the email they may not even know you emailed them they may see the text they emailed them and be like Psh, I'm not checking my email so um, it, the more times you send them the link the more likely they're going to be to join because they can't use I don't have your link as an excuse. Does that make sense? Okay. All right. Now the fun part, the trigger. You thought we were done, didn't you? We're not done. Okay. Go to triggers. Add a trigger. And this is also... You're going to want to name it for the calendar you're doing this with. Okay. And we're going to say here, we're going to be like, appointment is confirmed in calendar. Okay, and then that's the demo calendar that you are going to use. And then here, we're going to do um, remove from all campaigns. And then we're going to do, you can do all kinds of things here, guys. You can like send yourself an email. You can text yourself. Um, it's really easy. So send email, um, put your email address in here, or you could use custom values again. Um, like you have a new scheduled appointment, da, da, da. or you can text yourself. Okay. Congrats. You have a new booked appointment. Um, and then you use the custom values. So you can be like, Full name is coming at appointment start date time for a snap audit. Okay. 
and then put your phone number in there or again use a custom value either one okay um, then you're gonna want to add them to a campaign and that campaign is gonna be that new one that you just created appointment reminder demo okay and then if you want to get fancy with your pipeline you're gonna update the opportunity leads and then qualifying call okay and that should be the next stage in the pipeline so you shouldn't have to turn this on you shouldn't have to turn that on um, and then you can also put like a lead value in here 2000 or however much um, you charge per month and then you turn it on and then you save it and now uh, you should be able to test this for yourself okay I want you guys to test I always say test 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 please go to your calendar okay and the way that you do that is you go to calendars and you click on this little guy okay and then you book an appointment with yourself and make sure that you get the text that you get the email that your card gets moved in the pipeline okay um, make sure that you go through all the correct campaigns and the way that you see the campaigns are you go to you go to contacts and you can click on one of these and you can see like all of the campaigns that you have been in before okay past campaigns right here so you can see I was testing the onboarding in this account and it worked but you can see that here I was in that campaign and now I'm in this uh, opportunity card okay all right guys I hope that was helpful and uh, if you like this give me a thumbs up and click like and subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell so you don't miss any more updates from me and uh, see you guys next week take care thanks so much for watching oh hey wait if you want to scale your marketing agency to the next level you're not going to want to miss our marketing agency Facebook group. It's completely free and focused for agency owners. We do weekly live trainings with top industry experts, and we also do exclusive interviews for our members. You can join here using this bit.ly link, and it's gonna take you through our messenger bot that will send you straight to the Facebook group. And we also have a full suite of courses available for agency and high level training. So don't miss this guys, go to the link below and we'll get you taken care of. See you soon.